Hello my beautiful internet friends. This video I am so freaking excited to bring to you guys because I feel like as monumental as this is for me, there's so many people who have sent me encouraging messages like out of the blue being like, hey, I know your you know, prostate disappointment is coming up. I hope it goes well and I hope you get a walk soon. So many of you guys are so incredibly invested in this with me that I am so excited to tell you guys about today and let's not waste any more time with words. Let's start with this morning. It's 8 a.m. and I might be getting a leg today. It's also October 11th, which is the one year anniversary of the day that I lost my leg. I'm really trying to control my expectations of today. I want to simultaneously think that like nothing good is gonna happen and also that I'm like gonna walk out of there with a leg today and I don't think either one of those things is gonna happen. I think there'll probably be some forward movement. <sighs> Super anxious. Um, we're gonna get our ceremonial Starbucks coffee for the ride up to Denver. Let's do this. Happy anniversary. There's always an answer, Joe. Right? I'm very filled with hope right now. You're very filled with hope? <laughs> What you're watching right now is me getting a direct socket. This is a totally different process than getting casted for other prosthetics. I've actually never seen of it or heard of it before. However, it's pretty darn cool. They literally build the socket directly on your leg, though it does come with some, uh, let's just say, interesting difficulties, which you'll see in just a moment here, but check this out. This is pretty amazing. We should tell you that this is your new leg. Are you okay with it? <laughs> <laughs> this is it. We're done. So I'm 
Australian. Yeah, go ahead. I'm Thanks, certain man. that I really want to. The first time I brought them in, it's like so bulky. Yeah. <laughs> I this one you can cut. Um, some of them have stitching across the top. Mm -hmm. Those ones you don't want to cut. But there's. I like this. Oh, pretty close. Okay. Oh, so it might be there. I did that. Oh! Did you get that on camera? Of course it did. You said get everything. I treat that as still teach you. <laughs> I would give it time. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm assuming. Really good. It's good to see you walking again after a year. We are home. Home and icing this puppy up because walking, uh, walking kind of aggravates it a little bit, but not nearly as much as I thought it would. It might actually be happening, guys. This may be real, legitimate, literal, and figurative steps forward. I feel like completely overwhelmed by emotions. I've kind of gone from like, holy crap, this is amazing, to like, oh my god, nothing's gonna work. Even if it feels good, it's never gonna work. Like that paralyzing fear to like, I'm so grateful that today went well. Holy crap, today went well. And there's no asterisk on there. There's no like, oh, it went well, but it just went well. I have a leg that is home with me. It's freaking awesome. It's so much lighter than the other ones. It fits better than the other ones. It looks so much better than the other ones, which is not the most important thing, but it's nice to like how your leg looks. I like how this one looks. I am emotionally and physically completely drained at this moment, but I'm, but I'm happy drained. I know that this is like the first step towards getting to where I actually want to go and I feel like I can see a little bit of that light. Like everything that I've gone through in the last 365 days might actually be worth it because after so much time I almost begin to forget why I did it in the first place because there's been so many issues. This is why I did it. These moments are the reason that I did it. It's not gonna be easy but it's so worth it. It's here. It's starting. And I don't know what tomorrow's gonna bring. I don't know if anything's gonna happen. Of course, I'm worried that something's gonna go wrong, but it's going wonderfully. It's actually going wonderfully right now. And I took steps. I even took steps hands-free, like holy crap. I did not expect to be able to do that. And yeah, my leg's pretty sore right now, but it's not horrible. Like I'm not in a ton of pain. I know like give it a few weeks and I'm gonna be like sobbing with happiness. I'm just, I feel like there's so much emotion in me right now that I can't, I'm only feeling like so much of it, you know? Cause I'm so overwhelmed and drained. I really can't wait to see where this goes. And I feel like for the first time in a long time, things are happening the way that I want them to happen. And I'm so grateful for that. I'm so thankful for that. Check this out guys. Like it even looks pretty freaking cool. Look at that. It's freaking awesome! My carbon fiber rocket foot! Can't wait to get to know you better and get a little more practiced on you. Maybe walk my dogs, eventually. Soon. Thank you to my patrons who help so much in so many different ways. One of which is helping me have the money available to be able to pay the deductible for things like this leg. 
you guys help me in more ways than you know and by watching this video you are helping me in more ways that you know thanks so much guys holy crap today was insane Whew, i feel like i'm gonna sleep for like 12 hours tonight but first we're gonna go party and by party i mean like have some water and, and maybe a drink and some appetizers because that's my kind of party i love you guys i'm thinking of you and i'll see you in the next video bye guys Say, have you heard from the sky?